a three week trip to um, either California or Spain or Italy or China, um, wherever it is. And there are quizzes or essays or projects that are associated with that. We were learning about current events in China. We learned about Chinese menus, about Chinese culture, um, Chinese language. We, we had a couple different um, language sessions so we could learn just very basic numbers and um, conversational Chinese so that we can kind of fare over there. So every day on our way to different locations or to meet different people, we in the bus we would, uh, whoever the group leader for the day was, would give us all five questions. And throughout the day you would have to find the answers to those questions by talking to the people. And it really gave you this chance to force yourself to open up and ask questions that you probably wouldn't ask. And um, as, when we'd get back on the bus after, we would talk about the questions, not just question answer, but have a discussion about it, what we felt about the place, and compare, like in the same day, we'd go to a small winery versus a large one. And we would talk about how they're different, which one we liked better for certain reasons, what we didn't like, and uh, we did presentations on all the places we went. So before you're arriving, you already have background information. So when you're there, you're open and receiving all of everything they're telling you. There was three papers that we had to write, one at the beginning um, after our first week, one after our second week, and then one at the final um, our, after we were done with the trip. There was a, a third paper we had to write. And then in addition to that, we also had two quizzes during the trip, um, one, one on the first week and one on the second week, where we were given a piece of paper by Chef Chang and it was in Chinese, it was in Chinese characters, but then there's also um, sort of a, an English phonetic sounding for the word. So we had that, but there was no English translation anywhere on the paper. Um, and we had to go out and procure whatever it was that was written on the paper from any different location that was also specified on this paper that we couldn't understand. So um, we did it in two different cities as well. So there was a, a choice of different locations that we'd have to go to, but we had to figure out which one it was, we had to figure out what the item was that we were supposed to buy, and then also how many. Um, so we would rely on other people, again, the, the goodness of strangers, to try and translate things and point us in the right direction. 